Michael with your pickle boying tip today. We'll see if this uh, works. This is the little alcohol wipe, sorry about the shadow, that comes with the pickle boying. And this, you wipe around the blue edge. Of the suction cup when it comes to you it's clean and then it picks up dirt and stuff and becomes less sticky over time that's why you want to keep it wrapped up around the hook and in the baggie but these alcohol swabs clean that and bring back the tackiness and that's particularly important um, if you want to attach it to your racket to practice dink shots if it's just on the court, I've filled a sock with some coins and, uh, and that works fine on the cold days. As the alcohol dries, I can feel it um, become sticky. I usually put it right down on the throat of the racket and press down and, uh, you know, it'll hold well. Then, if you wrap the cord up around the hook, and you can obviously do it before or after, to shorten the cord to just so that the swivel is outside, then you can, that's the best length for practicing dinking. And it's tough to do. I always bend, bend it like this, and then you can wind it very quickly. So just so that the swivel is outside, then uh, to the throat of the racket like this, press it so it stays. And it really won't make much difference what side you hit it on. That's how you uh, attach to the racket. And again, it's 40 degrees, it's a pretty cold day, but because I've just cleaned the uh, suction cup with the alcohol swipe, it uh, stays pretty good. This is the only suction cup that uh, just lucked out that I like the suction cup, but this is one that will stick to any racket that's, uh, that's a legal racket. Hope that helps you, over and out.